and regulations have been uh, very detrimental to my business. Uh, starting in 1990, uh, we went from having basically uh, being able to catch anything or keep anything that we caught to uh, a seven fish bag limit uh, for our customers. We were open year round. Uh, now we're down to a two fish bag limit. This last year, the season was only open 64 days. So uh, it's really detrimental to our business to try to operate you know, in such a short season for red snapper, which is our primary fish. Our fish, our fishing this year was really on the way due to the, uh, the shortened season. Uh, hopefully, uh, we can do something to rectify that situation and get us back uh, where we can uh, go a little bit uh, better again. Because I think that uh, if we continue on this path, as the uh, number of red snapper continues to increase as the stock increases, they're going to be more easily uh, caught because they'll be more readily available to other fishermen that weren't catching them in the past. And uh, so as the stock recovers, it's just going to get worse and worse. So that's why we want to try to see if we can get an IFQ uh, for our sector. And that way we'll be sort of protected from, uh, from those consequences in the future. It would allow me the flexibility to fish when I wanted to. Uh, I can certainly make more money carrying, my, my, my largest boat has a capacity of 83 for instance, and I can make a lot more money making one trip on the boat with 83 people than I can four trips with 40 people on the boat because the fuel costs and everything, especially this last year, were so high. Um, so it, I could actually catch fewer fish with the, with the one trip and, and make as much money as I could with the four trip. So um, in these times, uh, you know, we have to try to maximize our profits if possible. I think that it would um, give me the opportunity for the flexibility. I can, uh, I can you know, maximize my profits, I believe, uh, with, uh, with a given number of fish. I mean, if I catch the same number of fish now, it's costing me a lot more money because I make a number of trips where I don't have the boat full. I could, uh, I could schedule trips where I knew the boat would be, would be full, and not necessarily just during the, you know, opening season or the open season that the, the National Marine Fishery Service uh, or the Gulf Council dictates. I think I can prosecute my business, my business better than they can. It's basically what it amounts to.